Metastatic melanoma is the most dangerous form of skin cancer because the cancer is spread beyond the skin to other parts of the body. Melanoma is a cancer of the pigment-producing cells of the skin. In the earliest stages of the disease, these cancer cells remain in the skin. A melanoma may look like an abnormal mole, and if identified at this stage, melanoma is often completely treatable with surgery. However, about 7% of melanomas occur in harder to detect parts of the body, such as the eye, genitals, mouth, or bottom of the feet. If the melanoma is left untreated or undetected, or if the initial treatment doesn't work, or the cancer isn't surgically removable, melanoma can eventually reach other parts of the body. When it spreads to organs such as the brain, lungs, liver, or bones, it is classified as stage 3 or 4 melanoma, also known as metastatic melanoma. Sadly, metastatic melanoma is projected to cause nearly 10,000 deaths in the U.S. in 2014. The five-year survival rate is 15 to 20 percent, and the 10-year survival rate is about 10 to 15 percent. Survival rates vary depending on several factors, including the stage of the cancer, the number of metastases, if a person has a weakened immune system, and the location of the original melanoma. Age and race also affect outcomes. Despite these statistics, many patients are surviving longer because there are more promising treatments available for metastatic melanoma than ever before. Traditionally, metastatic melanoma was treated with radiation, chemotherapy, and surgery if appropriate. But patients are now being treated with immunotherapy, which boosts the immune system ability to destroy cancer cells. Additional immunotherapy drugs are also showing good promise for patients. Targeted therapy is another type of melanoma treatment, but isn't appropriate for everyone. For example, there are certain drugs that only work on people who have tumors with a mutated form of a protein called BRAF. This abnormal protein causes unchecked tumor growth and targeted therapy aims to turn the mutation off. Side effects and treatment resistance associated with these therapies can present significant obstacles, but these treatments for metastatic melanoma have contributed to improve outcomes for patients. Many other medications are currently in clinical trials. If you or your loved one has been diagnosed with metastatic melanoma, there are plenty of reasons to be hopeful.